The race that we have here is against the virus itself. On Saturday, 3,000 vaccines were distributed at the Circuit of the Americas as part of a mass vaccine distribution site. The Texas Division of Emergency Management has helped us immensely in COVID testing, and now we have the opportunity to turn the corner with mass vaccinations. The event was a collaboration of Travis Caldwell, Hayes, and Bastrop counties. The county judges say this is a major step in getting more vaccine into the community. And this is a perfect example of what we can do when we come together. They've all been working together, adding this is a nonpartisan issue. COVID does not recognize if you're a Republican or a Democrat. It, it, it just doesn't care. Rather, they say more importantly, it's about working to get those in the community vaccinated. The quicker that we can get 80% of people in our region vaccinated, the quicker that we will reach herd immunity and we'll be able to get back to business and live music and bars and restaurants and everything that we want to get back to doing. And say a site like this is the first step. As you know, every journey, whether a, a mile or a thousand miles, starts with one step. And this is a fabulous step in the beginning of that journey. I think this is the way that Texas is going to get back on its feet and move forward in a faster pace. Travis County Judge Andy Brown says mass sites like this can reach more than what could be done in a single county site. And as more vaccines come in through the state, there may be more sites like this in the future. The goal is to do as much as possible. So if we're up to 10,000 per day here and there's more vaccines, we'll open up additional sites around the county. Hayes County Judge Ruben Becerra adding state and federal leaders, even taking notice of what's being done here. We deserve it, we can manage it, and we are here to show you that we are ready. Put us in, coach.